Hi everyone. We are familiar with the parable of the prodigal son, in which the son returns to his father to express his regret for his wayward living. The father had all the rights to be angry towards his son, but the father welcomes him with great compassion. No bitter words are spoken between the father and the son. The father doesn't accuse his son. In our society, we find just the opposite. Those who are in anger and hatred keep on accusing others in all foul language, causing a lot of harm. We may have experienced harm by the words of others. So we are aware how deeply a person can be hurt by certain words. Therefore, before we speak, we need to think how much a person is going to be hurt by our words. In other words, we need to taste the bitterness of the word before we speak it out. It is better to avoid speaking when we are angry because it is then that there are all the possibilities to hurt the other to whom we are speaking. Words can be sharper than knives at times, which pierce through the heart of the other. It takes just a moment to do that, but it takes a lifetime to heal that wound. The father in the parable of the prodigal son is a beautiful example of how to handle our language and manner of speaking in all situations. We need to keep our words holy, non-hurting, and always prefer silence, even if the truth is on our side. Control our tongue, and never bring accusations against any that may spoil the reputation of the other. Proverbs 21-23 says, He who guards his mouth and tongue keeps himself from trouble. Jesus teaches us, do to others as you would have them do to you. We don't want to be hurt by the words of others. In the same way, let us keep ourselves from hurting others by our words. May God bless us all and have a blessed day.